Welcome, everyone. Thank you so much for coming out today. Hope y'all are having a fantastic day. All right, guys. So today we've got another dungeon. Don't worry, I'm running the correct dungeon this week, finally. It's called Den of the Seething Hell. It's an easy difficulty swamp dungeon this week. Loot this week, guys. Tech implant chamber, tech rifle, the ghillie mask, and tech leggings. So, uh, not too bad. Boss this week should... This week should be the Obsidio Equus. Talking's hard. Um, especially in the morning. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Crazy meet me. Ellen, hello. Ducky, hello. Trailblazer, Ahmed, Thunder. Oh my gosh. Welcome, everybody. Southern Wolf, Zachary. Hi. Uh, why is your Mui 13 arc not working? Your 13 arc. Uh, which device is this? Because that's probably why. All right, guys, so there are wolves this week. All right, I'm taking all of these things because uh, I'm going to go do a pego room, and that's actually very handy. Wait for that. Uh... The first thing we're going to do is hit the Pega Room, because the Pega Room is completely optional. But if you like your Pega Mastex and you want a couple, this is a good week to get them, because it's a fairly easy dungeon with a fairly easy boss. Doo, doo, doo. Ah, Red Me. Gotcha, gotcha. Red Me's have always struggled with Ark. Um, to the best of my knowledge, they've never had a really easy time with it. And especially now with a lot of newer phones not having compatibility with Arc Mobile just because of the way that they haven't been maintaining the code. Um, it's, it doesn't surprise me that you have something that doesn't, it isn't super compatible, if that makes sense. All right, I'm gonna put those there, and those there, and those there. Yeah. That ought to be good. They can take all of the other stuff. I'm going to move these up here. Okay. Hopefully they take everything else. Uh, but it is a pego room, so you never know. Make them jump to me. No, oh, they took my jerky. No, I want my item. I want my... Mm. Okay, we're gonna... We're gonna do one of these. Why are their bodies still here? Here we go. I don't want the narco berries. I do want the canteen. Oh, almost lost all my food. Pegos are kind of a pain. I don't really need the fish meat. I was just bringing it. No, I lost the canteen. Um, those I want. I don't really care for that. I brought um a I brought an extra uh bunch of fish meat for something for them to grab. That apparently was a good move. But they did. I did lose a canteen. That is the risk. I would bring in just like a bunch of junk, a uh, bunch of junk berries, bunch of junk meat, spoiled meat, things you don't really care too much for. It'll help prevent this. A little iffy, but there we go. At least I saved the most important things. Pego rooms, man. Oh, I got a Carno statue. Always love that. All right, we're gonna go this way and up here. 
Oh, forgot about Al. And the next level wolf. It's also a good week to get uh, eerie wolves. They are just in the hallways, by the way. This is a max level. Not as good as a uh, event eerie wolf that you can get from the snow cave, but still. Lystro, Packy. I believe Pelagornis are also one of the creatures this week. All right, there we go. I was looking for that. And there's an optional tile trap here. I saw that wolf just like beat it into the corner. That's kind of amazing. Alrighty, welcome everybody. Hello. Hank, I stream you can finally you can actually watch live. Welcome. Oh, I was a little off center, but I made it. Okay. That was scary. I always struggle with these tile traps. They're a little bit longer than the normal ones, so I'm just not as confident on them. Let me go this way. Poison. Goodbye, wolf. Okay. That's that. Uh, that's this little tiny chunk of the dungeon. Completely optional. You do not have to do it. You can save yourself a tile trap. You can save yourself um, a little bit of heartache. You can save yourself uh, the loss of items because you don't have to do the pega room if you don't want to. Uh, can you make the swamp jump without aerial symbiotes? Game Master, yes you can. You can jump over on the yellow tiles. Um, there are patterns to them. I just, I'm really, really bad at platformers. Like, I... <laughs> If there's a platform game or a, a jump from this to that game, I I am in the pit every time. It's an honest problem. Um, I don't even understand how I'm so bad at it after years of practice, but I am. So I just jump over them. Because if I try to jump from tile to tile, I will uh, inevitably slide off one of the tiles for no reason and die. <laughs> Smoo, hello. How are you? Uh... Talk to Cookie Earler. He's going to get more feeding troughs and preserving bins for me. Oh, thank goodness. Thank you so much, Scott. Definitely needed. Definitely needed. I'm going to need, like, several now that the base is big enough to actually work with. Um, I actually should hopefully have time to log on tonight and do some stuff. Uh, it is a busy day at work, but that's okay. I can log on after work because I probably shouldn't be playing games at work anyway. Actually, normally I don't. That's why I haven't been on during the day as much uh, for the last, like, year. All right. Let's go this away. All right. I need to do the whole right side of the dungeon now to get the facility key. And, guys, if you cannot find the map, uh, then we can probably find a link to it. Cookie. Thank you. Um... You could probably find a link to it at some point. Oh. Ha! <laughs> Alright. I think the Packies win this. Sorry, guys. This is 100% worth taking a little time to watch. Maybe the Packies don't win this. No, they they definitely don't. I'll help. I saved this Packy's life. He's so thankful he's he's asking me to like pet him. Good job, buddy. Good job. You tried your best. I'm sorry I couldn't save your friend. I thought you were better than you were. Um, alright, let's see. Nothing here. Wolf. Swing. Map. All right. Uh, I'm gonna run down here and grab this guy. Lystro. Bones. Do 
20 black pearls. I always love to see those. Ow. All right, we're going to run up this way. Ha! I missed him. Is wolf. Is several wolves. That was a very drawn out howl for a dead wolf. I'm just saying. I feel like the sound should have been canceled. All right. So, this, guys, this is a Carno room. Um, I think. I think it's just a regular Carno room. It's not a juggernaut room. I actually don't know. I actually don't know. Kenzie, hello. You had your first job interview today and another one for a different company next Tuesday. <gasps> Congrats, Kenzie. That's fantastic news. Oh, I'm excited for you. You can finally work. Oh, they're the tiny Carnos. I remember now. Baby Carnos. All right, well... Give me a little space so I can shoot you properly. Tiny Carno time. Uh, which one to target first? Probably this guy. Ah, oh, you mate boosted. Thanks for, like, standing there. He turned aside to me like a target. Excited to finally have money. I know, right? Yeah, my trip is coming up next Friday. So less than two weeks. It's about ten days now. I am so excited. Um... Everything's all sorted out where we're staying and stuff. I'm going to be in Dublin for like three days. And then Galway for three days after like a week. Uh, going all around Southern Ireland, basically. I'm like super stoked. Going to visit some family over there too, which is lovely. Wish you could be in the Twitch streams. Me too, Kenzie. I'll miss you over there. Um, it's been quiet without you. It's making me think I want to, like, maybe do a morning stream, but we'll see. I don't know. Or more Saturday streams or something. All right. Thread's been cleared. We good. Double checking. Um, let's get these loot crates here. So slow. So slow. There we go. Um, Zachary says, remember me? Yes, Zachary. You saw my revamp video? It's the first time you saw my face. You thought I had brown hair. Oh my gosh, Zachary. Yeah. Um, I've done a face reveal video before. This is a thing. Nope, I have always been a redhead, though. That's a wolf. Thought he'd have less health than that. All right. Okay, we're going up here. We're going to grab this loot crate, and then we're going to head down through to the loot crate run that leads to the facility key. That's it for event rooms on this side of the gate. Um, just the two. One of them's completely optional. Carnos are necessary if you're trying to get to the gate, but that's okay. Ugh, poison traps. Always a wolf. Oh, he was a level five. What a baby. Little wolf. Tiny wolf. Have fun. You want to travel, but finance are tough. Pirate's going to be in Switzerland soon for work, so you're jelly. Oh, my gosh. Congrats to him. Um, That's awesome. I'm glad he gets to travel a little bit. I can imagine why you'd be jealous. <laughs> All right. I need water. Got to run down this way. Um, hopefully soon, you know, once you get that job going, you never know. Okay, there's a bunch of wolves in here. 
Little pack. There. Now they're not strong. Long howls. For little guys. There it is. That's what I wanted. Okay. This is what I wanted. I wanted to come get all of these loot crates off this room. All right, all the way down here. Uh -huh. Then up. Grab that. More black pearls, wow. This is the place to get black pearls. Every time. They always get behind me. It's a skill, I swear. Here we go. Oh, I'm about to sneeze. As soon as he comes back, he has jury duty. <laughs> that figures. That's amazing. I'll love that. It does suck, though. Um, I'm real glad. I don't think I've ever had jury duty. Not once. I've been, like, one of the rare lucky ones. Uh, you're waiting for an update to solve a glitch? Uh, with me, Dilly. Well, there aren't any planned updates until the end of 2023, and then it's a whole revamp of the game. Um, so we shall see. We shall see. I hope we get that. A few updates in between would be lovely, but I'm not, I'm not holding my breath for it. I'll grab that loot crate. We're almost there. Ow. Grab that loot crate. That's the facility key, guys. Right there. And then we're gonna hit an optional, um... Optional premium chest. That's what it is. This is a different type of map than I'm used to, so the chest symbols are all different. Alright. Three bullets. There we go. We need food. Luckily, I brought much cooked meat jerky. Many. All right, so we have another tile jump. I'm gonna, I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. I don't trust myself on these. If I could actually hit the right button, that would be lovely. There we go. Good night, Smoo. Thank you so much for stopping by. Oh my goodness. Ah, gotcha, Kenzie. Yeah, that's not unusual. It does happen. Um, if you're not available, like, they can't, like... They generally can't force you to come unless, uh... You know. You're in a place where they can get you. There we go. There we go. Okay. Down this way. Got it. Gravel half pavers. Ow. Ow. So that was not a premium that I would have considered worth it. But you never know with those. Sometimes you get really good stuff. Wish they would take the half pavers out. I have so many. Alrighty. So that's the whole uh, pre- Pre-facility gate part of the dungeon. Have not found a single water thingy yet, which is upsetting. Alright, we gotta go all the way back to the beginning and then down to the gate. A little twisty. There. Dodging poison stuff. Okay. 
Yay, I did that. Um, <laughs> you were still afraid. That's fair, especially if it's like your first ever summons. That's, you know, not an easy thing to deal with. AB, how's it going? Hope you're having a great day. Welcome on in. Got a wolf in my in my starting zone. Almost. It's not quite the starting zone, but you know. Close enough. We go this way. It's a long run back. Not as long as some dungeons, but long enough. Yay. Okay, starter room. Now we go center. Left and then right, and then you have to go central to get to the actual facility gate. This is the last swamp jump trap. Um, there are two water rooms on the other side of this, which I am so excited for. Uh, they're unfortunately a little ways out, but that's all right. Water rooms are water rooms. Oh, my aerial symbiote may break soon. It has served me well. It's about time to discard that. Jump around until it breaks. It's half the fun these days. Alrighty. There is the... Uh, I love when they put it on the poison like that. <laughs> Wolf's getting himself killed. Right, I'm gonna bust through. There we go. Bust through and kill the wolves. All right, and now it's all just um, three more event rooms, which are not as bad as a pega room. Send it flat gauntlets, that's lovely. Run down this away. Already did that. There it is. Chest. Lovely. All right, and here we have an event room. Juggernaut Titanomirma drone and Titanomirma soldier minion. So ants, lots of ants. Looking for the drone. Okay, too many ants. There we go. Gotta get the drone first. Oh, hi. He was late to the party. That one little ant. Alright, let's go this way. I'm gonna grab the loot crates over here. Pelagornis, hi. Battle Tartar. Another wolf. I'm getting bit a lot. Um, I probably could shoot these guys rather than using my sword, but I don't want to waste my bullets. <laughs> All right. Water. Okay. Ha! Huh? They didn't even notice me. There were wolves in that room, and they didn't even notice me. Love that. Okay. Um, on to the next event room, which is right next door. That's an Araneo room. We are going to use the shotgun on that one. Imagine they put a bug spray in the game. They did. Um, there's a bug repellent. Imagine if you could just, like, I don't know, like a... Uh, I always think of it as, like, a wasp spray because you can, like... Spray it and kill them from a distance with, like, poison. Yeah. That would be nice. Uh, can you tame Eerie's in the dungeon? Lazy Gun, no. You cannot tame in the dungeon. You do have to kill them and bring them out of the dungeon to tame.
Oh, it's a growing Aranea threat. Oh, he's way down there. Okay, growing threat's really easy. It's just one. It's just one spider. Now we've got the clicking. Oh, I hate the clicking. Where is he? Ah! Always watch your back. There he is. He's, they're like too big to actually properly hit you with the webs too. All right, there we go. <laughs> Borky dogs. Borky dogs. All the time. Quit! Oh my goodness. Why are they so loud? My apologies, stream. Um, your scream scared you more than the spider? Oh, sorry. It was scary. There was a spider behind me. Actually, I love spiders, but, you know, it spooked me because I wasn't expecting him. Or at least I wasn't expecting him there. Alrighty. We're going to go this way because there's water rooms down this way and a premium chest, and I'm all about that. No. Yes. Yes, there is. Oh, your mate boosted. Where's your buddy? There he is. Hi. Another max level. The wolves aren't much of a problem unless... Uh... Oh, gosh. Which way to go? This way. The wolves aren't much of a problem unless you've got... Did I already get this? No. Uh, unless you're on like a harder brutal difficulty. Even on hard, they're not that bad, but on brutal, they're probably a pain. No. Okay. One down, two to go. But there's a couple of water rooms this way. I'm very excited. Da, ah, Packy, hi. Do I go that way? I guess it doesn't matter. There is a water room, though. It is a swamp water room, so you gotta be careful. Because there's leeches. Alright. We need food. Alright, now I'm gonna swap out that. Because there's another water room down the way. Okay. And there's another water room here. And a premium. Yay, gravel half paper. I can hear the leeches squelching around. That's awful. Okay, I'm all good though. We did it. Ow. Oh, that's optional. There is a jump trap there, but it's completely optional. We're going around. We're going through the water room. Water room any day of the week. I don't have a leech on me, do I? Keep hearing the noise. So there is a swamp jump trap down there. It wasn't marked on the map. It is optional completely. You can go straight around it. I would advise that.
The wolf will never catch me now. Okay, um, we're on to the last one, guys. This is it. This is the last room. All right, so this is Dragonaut Dilo and Araneo Minions. So there's Dilophosaurus in here. Take a medical brew. <laughs> Doggo, you love dogs. Me too. How's Zen? Uh, Zen's good. Zen's just been chilling. He's working from home. Uh, except for when he has to go on work trips, which are not fun. But no, it's been really good. Uh, everything's going fantastic right now. Forgot, where's the Dillo? There it is. The Juggernaut room. What am I doing? There we go. Ah! Bonus wolf. That is not part of the room. <laughs> that was good timing. Just barely managed to do that. Okay, let's go up here. This should be tech structure. Tech structure loots up here. Got it. Tech window frame. Lovely. Do like. <laughs> Rox, how's it going? Hope you're having a great day. All right, and over here is the featured loot. What do we get? What do we get? Implant chamber. Nice. I already have a million, but that's okay. They're so e they're so good. Uh, this is a good week to run, guys, if you don't have a tech implant chamber. It's just a good idea. They're very useful. Don't know if that wolf is going to follow me all the way in here. Don't know if he can. What's my armor looking like? Pretty good. The rest of me is looking pretty good, too. There we go. That wolf is, like, super upset, but he can't get to me now, so it's too late. Let's start the weekly pursuit. All right. I'm going to throw up a quick save. Always. Always throw up a quick save before the boss fight if you're on single player. Um... What is the tech implant chamber? So it allows you to extend the timer on your implants. So if you have like an eerie implant that you want to revive or a creature that died, but you don't have the amber yet, you stick it in the implant chamber with some element and it will infinitely extend. Um, it basically freezes the countdown timer on the implants. So it's a really handy thing. I love using it for... Uh, eerie creatures that I like just don't want to revive yet. It's very handy. Ellen, welcome. Welcome on in. There we go. No worries about the lurk. We have the Obsidian Eucharist. My mount. I like. Thingy didn't want to move yet. There we go. This is my favorite boss. No, don't hit me. Hitting is rude. Yeah, do your big burp. Wow, why all the way down there? The trick is getting out around the barrels enough to hit him, but not so far out that he can hit you. Ooh. Ow! Oh, he got me. Ow! I'm, like, offended a little. Ow. Ow. Uh-oh. My stimulants are, like, barely working. There we go. I'm a little hurt. You really cannot let that thing hit you.
Play with the barrels. Shoot him in the butt. Ah! That's fine, I guess. Ow! This is maybe the worst I've ever done on this boss. Normally he throws barrels. Ah, my gosh. There it is. Oof. Okay. Well, that was fun. Um, could have been worse. Could have been smoother. Could have been worse. How did I get that much potent medical brew? I run dungeons. I have never made a potent medical brew in my whole entire Arc Mobile career. I think once, maybe. And it was not worth it. Um, I just run dungeons and I collect them. You get them in like pairs. You get them two at a time from chests occasionally. And I just stack them in a fridge until I get a bunch of them. And I'm too lazy to make regular ones. And then I use them. It's all right. There we go, guys. Um, quite, quite literally my favorite boss. There we go. Bonus wolf equals bonus scare. Yeah. More fun that way. Oh, I forgot about the black pearls. Oh, I'm lucky I can still move. Okay. Well, got quite a bit of stuff. Um, I did get 60 black pearls from that dungeon, which is a, a large amount. See, you get all these, like, good premium brews. The adaptogenics, the staminas, the hemostatics. Um... You sometimes get regular energy brews. Sometimes you get potent ones. So I just take all that stuff and I, uh, and I save it. Just realize the water is very AP. Yeah. Um, it's actually really handy because you have built-in protections in that room. You're only drunk when you're standing in the beer and you don't have to worry about water in the Obsidio Equus fight. It's really nice. So you get all of the, like, damage reduction effects in that arena. Um... Which is lovely. So, it's a whole thing. How do you get the Ascendant Pop Shotgun? Also by running dungeons. I got my first one by running uh, the Snow Cave. And then I got... This one by running dungeons. Uh, it's pretty rare to get a good one, but I did finally, after like three years, get a good pump action shotgun. Alright, guys. Um... There we go. There we go. I think that's everything, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out. Super appreciate it. Hopefully you guys had a good time. And yeah, uh, I'll be here for next week's dungeon, but I will be missing two dungeons the first two weeks of May. So my apologies, guys, but I have run all of the dungeons before. So if you need to look them up, you can find them on my channel. Just type in Iguana Gaming and the name of the dungeon, and you'll find the videos. It'll be good. All right, guys. Please remember to hit the like button on the way out. It seriously does help me out. And if you want to see more content like this, you can, of course, subscribe. And I'm going to go ahead and catch you all in the next one. Signing off, this is the Iguana.